For years, my mother-in-law traveled to downtown Brooklyn for work, and she would park under the tracks every day and walk to her office. And every morning at 8.30, she'd see the same large homeless man, often drunk, sitting right near her car. Now, at first she was really nervous, but every morning she'd say good morning, and every night she would say good night to him. And pretty soon, she was able to see past his exterior, and she felt a little more comfortable. One day after work, as she's walking to her car, she sees car after car after car, every window is smashed. She was sure that her window would be broken also. But when she got to her car, hers was totally fine. And all the cars after it were also smashed. She looks up at the homeless man and he's smiling and nodding. And he said, I told him, uh-uh, not that one. Don't touch that one. Just saying hello to this homeless man every day, looking beneath the surface and acknowledging him made him feel such gratitude that he stood up for her when these car thieves came. You know, the Gemara in Bracha says that when Rabbi Yochanan would walk past anyone, he would always be the first to say hello to them. When we greet and acknowledge other people, it doesn't only change how they see us, it changes how we see them. You know, the world is finally starting to take off their masks. But when we only see people on a surface level, it's as if they're still wearing their mask. Let's try to look deeper. Let's make it a point to be the first ones to say hello. And let's change the way we see each other.